and just came to me and I'm very excited about it. It's my brand new GoPro Hero 7 Black. This is my old camera, the GoPro Hero 7 Black that I had for about three years. I'm using the GoPro Hero 8 and this is like about my fifth take on this video just because the GoPro Hero 8 is that way. It rolls like that, right? You push the record button, you have no idea what the camera's gonna do, right? The GoPro Hero 8 is just full of glitches. And um, just, just it can do anything right um when you press record um and it can stop recording and then start recording all of a sudden just for no reason um the batteries the batteries do not last as long on the gopro hero 8 because i'm using the gopro hero 7 black batteries in it the gopro hero 8 black batteries are just complete garbage right just the design of them um and but the seven blacks batteries still work in the eights they just don't work, work as long so let's look inside the camera here you know, it's, um, this old camera does not work anymore because it does not read cards anymore. The battery terminals, the prongs down there, um, have no more gold on them because I've taken so many batteries in and out of the camera. Um, uh, I, this, this camera, this camera was new, 300, about $329, and it came with all kinds of stuff. Um, it came with all kinds of different mounts, and it came with a headset, it came with a, a sticky, a stick thing. It came with a, um, uh, one battery. It came, this, this camera came with one battery. This camera here, this new GoPro Hero 7 Black, came with two batteries and just like a couple mounts here, um, just sticky mounts, and that's pretty much it. And the camera, and it came with the case too. It just came with the case. Four hundred dollars, right? Four hundred bucks. You know, um, I don't know why the price of the camera went up so much, but I, I can guess. You know, nobody wants to buy the GoPro Hero Eights. You know, you look at the GoPro Hero Eights, and you can get them for really cheap um, because they're just garbage. Um, these seven sevens and sixes are very well sought after. Everybody wants these older cameras because they're they're they have the same processor pro, uh, processor board on the seven as the eight nine whatever you know um they're just trying to push the camera too much on the the uh newer cameras with the same processor so they just overheat you know um the gopro hero 7 black i really didn't have much overheating problem very seldom would i have overheating problems and it's just not glitchy right when, when i push this record button up here i know for sure uh, uh, probably 99 percent of the time it's going to work. It's going to start recording and I can trust that when I push that record button, when it's on my head, it's it's recording. Um, just in the last few months, it's been kind of glitchy. Um, my, my um, the, the last couple months of use with this camera here, it's it's been really been through a ringer. You can see it, you know, it's been dropped many times and submersed in the water many times. Um, it start, I started having a glitch to where um, my audio was was um, not in sync with my video, but um, you know, the the GoPro Hero 8, I think about 75, 80 percent of the time when I push that button, it's not going to record, right? It's going to do something completely different, like go on the menu button or it's going to turn off or it's going to turn on or it just does all kinds of weird stuff when I push that record button. Um, just never know what it's going to do. But, um, you know, the the sticker inside inside of this camera, there's, there's two stickers. There's a... a there's a model sticker and then there's a serial number and those stickers are just gone you know just have been gone for a long time because i've pulled my batteries in and out so many times but the gopro hero 8 black um has the door I'm, i can't show you because i have that camera on my head right now it has the the battery and the sd card on the side here it's just really funky just how the whole design of the camera it has the um the gopro hero 8 does not have a, a changeable lens right you cannot um swap out your lens so once you scratch the gopro hero 8 black lens you are freaking done that thing has to go to repair center and get a new lens on it and why do that you know it costs you just much to buy a, a good camera like a seven all right <laughs> And uh, so the camera that's on my head right now is probably going to be smashed with the hammer here pretty soon, all right? Um, because I, and I'm, I'm thinking about getting um, another brand of camera, most likely a DJI or something, um, 
probably a, a, just another brand camera, a good camera. You know, when when I um when I'm out there metal detecting in different harsh terrain, and when I'm in the rain, I'm in I submerge it in the water. Um, I'm I'm taking the card in and out every day. I'm taking batteries in and out all the time. You know, on the camera because I'm recording all the time when I'm out in the field, when I'm metal detecting. I want the camera, first of all, I want the camera to be durable. And, you know, it, I, I don't care about the price. I just want the camera to, to really be durable and handle a lot of abuse, you know, dropping, you know, taking, you know, a lot of dust, you know, because I'm around dust, right? If I try to take a phone out to um, metal detect with, it's nearly impossible to make videos with it. And the dust just gets inside your camera and just, your phone and just destroys it that's why i don't take my a lot of times i don't take my phone with me when it's when the ground is dry because the dust just ruins cameras ruins ruins phones and what electronics and um the number one is just the durability i want it to be durable and i don't care about the price you know i just want it to last um i don't want to have to uh change change parts or have it repaired often and this this gopro hero 7 black really was a good freaking camera i'm really 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 happy about this purchase i am not happy about the purchase of the gopro hero 8 black um it's just pretty much everything about the camera it just doesn't make sense i don't know what the engineers were engineers were thinking when they um develop this i mean it's just so much different than the gopro hero so it may look like the same camera but it's not um and i did buy both of them both these cameras from a reputable reputable place uh best buy um and they were are both the seven and eight black this camera and the camera that i'm using right now are both had serial numbers on them too and this camera um and the 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 third thing is the third most important thing when I have a camera when I'm out metal detecting, first is durability. Second is, um, uh, is is uh, I don't care about the price. You know, I just want it to work. Um, bas basically, just um, dependability. And the third, the third is I, I want to have trust in this camera. When I push that record button, I want to know that I'm recording. I want to have 100% trust in that camera. When I push that button, when it's on my head, I cannot see it. I don't know what it's doing. I want to know that that. I want to know what the, the camera is doing when I push that button. I want to be. I want to have 100% faith that camera is recording. And with the GoPro Hero 8, I have zero confidence, absolutely zero confidence that I'm actually recording. That's why it took me over five takes to do just this video right here because I'm having to fumble with the camera and, and fiddle with it. And I had to go upstairs to get a new battery because the battery died. And um, this new camera here is going to really make my videos a lot better the last month month and a half or so it's been very very difficult to get good videos in and the gopro hero 8 does not record for as long for one video the gopro hero 7 black just a lot better footage the audio is better um i can rely on that camera button that record button when i push that button it's recording i don't have to freaking mess with it and um the batteries work a lot longer in the gopro hero 7 um the screen is easier to scroll the interface is easier to understand um the gopro hero 8 black is just all around just a huge failure for me right um just every everything about the gopro hero 8 black i've just it just has driven me nuts that's why i think i'm gonna take this camera might meet a hammerhead <laughs> this camera right freaking here man <laughs> um it's just, it's really tested my patience a lot um it tested my patience a lot at first when i first was using the um hero 8 a couple years ago but now that i'm forced to use it um of course i went back to my gopro hero 7 you know when i bought this 8 i went back to my gopro hero 7 because this GoPro Hero 8 just doesn't work very good. And then now that I was forced to use my GoPro Hero 8 um, because my GoPro Hero 7 black broke, um, my patience is, was really tested <laughs> to the freaking limits, man. <laughs> um, a lot of cussing, a lot of cussing. 
and um, this is why my video has been kind of short lately because uh, I just can't get the thing to stay recording. I can't get the thing to function right a majority of the time, probably 75% of the time, I just can't get the camera to work right. So if you guys are looking for a GoPro Hero 8 Black, look at the GoPro Hero 7 Black. It's about 50 or maybe 100 bucks more, but it works, right? It at least works, man. <laughs> The GoPro Hero 10 might work, but I'm not going to take that chance um, of buying a new camera. I just I, I just want a camera to work like this, this old GoPro Hero 7 Black. That's what I want a, a, a camera to how to function. Flawless, right? Just about flawless. We'll see about this one. Thank you for watching.